Cryonics is a procedure that preserves the human body at low temperatures after death, in the hope it can be revived in the future. The process must begin within two minutes of a person being declared legally dead. Although the heart has stopped beating, there is still some brain function during this period, so a heart-lung resuscitator is used to stabilize the body and keep the brain supplied with blood and oxygen. In the next step of the process, an anticoagulant is injected into the body to stop the blood clotting during transit. The body is then packed in ice and transported to a cryonics facility. Once there, a process called vitrification begins, where the blood is replaced with a cryoprotectant antifreeze fluid. This is done to prevent the cells from freezing and to stop ice crystals from forming around the organs at extremely low temperatures. The body is then placed on a bed of dry ice until it cools to minus 130 degrees Celsius. Once cooled sufficiently, the body is transferred to an individual container, which is in turn lowered into a larger metal tank that's filled with liquid nitrogen to keep the temperature at minus 196 degrees Celsius. Between four and six bodies are typically held in the tanks. They are stored with heads facing down to ensure the brains would stay immersed in the freezing liquid, even if there is a leak in the container.